Good morning, Steve Freed with the morning grain comments. Markets are mixed overnight. Beans are up about 15 cents in the Jan at around 13.66. Soybean oil is higher. Meals about unchanged. Corn's up one to two cents, while wheat's down four. Outside market looks like stocks are going to open up a little bit higher, while the dollar's a little bit lower, and crude's higher. Crude might be higher on top that uh, both Saudi Arabia and Russia reaffirmed their supply cuts. As far as the grains are concerned, um, I think South American weather is uh, supporting a higher soybean trade. Um, looks like Central and North uh, Brazil is going to remain mostly dry over the next uh, 10 days. Uh, Argentina is uh, getting some uh, good normal rains, while Southern Brazil is getting too much rain. So uh, there is some talk that as much as 20 to 25 percent of Brazil's soybean crop may need to be replanted, and this uh, all adds to some of the uh, uncertainty as to what kind of corn and soybean crop Brazil is going to have this year. We'll see if that offers any uh, support to our export market if China decides to switch some cargoes from Brazil to the U.S. or buy some U.S. corn. Right now, uh, there is talk about a few cargoes being switched, and uh, we are competitive, uh, both corn and soybeans, uh, starting about in December uh, through uh, the um, harvest period that starts in maybe March of uh, 2024 in South America. Uh, we did have a report this week. Uh, some people are adding uh, 20 million bushels to the U.S. soybean carry out due to a higher crop, lower exports, but <clears throat> some of that is offset by a higher crush. We also see an uh, increase in the corn carry out also due to a higher uh, <clears throat> corn crop and lower export number, but uh, some people are increasing the ethanol to offset that a little bit. As far as wheat is concerned, we're not expecting much change at all uh, in the uh, carryout. <clears throat> um, but for 24-25, we're still looking at a bigger crop and uh, maybe an increase in exports, depending upon what kind of supply there is in the southern hemisphere and what kind of uh, export pace there is out of Ukraine and, and just how much Russia can ship. But uh, still looking at <clears throat> maybe a 750 carryout uh, versus 670, and that continues to offer resistance uh, to the wheat market. So beans up on South American weather, corn up a little bit, wheat down, outside markets got uh, stocks higher, crude higher, and the dollar a little bit lower.